beautifuls. I'm just Jackie is here. I am here, beautifuls. Listen, I am here for this video. First of all, let me say shout out to Atos Wig. I hope I'm saying that right. Atos Wig. They are sponsoring this video. They actually sent me a wig to review. And the wig is called Okay, OC May. I mean OC My Lace Front Wig. It says heat resistant, fiber synthetic. Wig for women, loose wig for women, long loose curly wig lace front wig. Okay, it says glueless, cankling fiber, synthetic hair, and uh, the color I have is black twenty four. Okay, so they they are Amazon um Amazon store. They they sell through Amazon and everything. And um the packaging was nice. I actually pulled this out um one time you know just to see what it looked like and everything but i haven't done nothing with it so the, the packaging design that comes in the package like this i actually like the packaging because um y'all know like the other wigs i have and purchase they come in like that long with the cardboard and all that stuff like i figure if i get more wigs in this packaging i can actually store more wigs you know in my in my chest but I don't even have the chest no more. The chest got destroyed in that flood. But I haven't replaced the chest yet. But I do have like plastic tubs. But what I'm saying is it can compress. And I can get more wigs in there. So like, okay, y'all see this, right? So when I open it up, boom, boom. Okay, wig, right? So now it comes with, um, ooh, my. I swear something just really just fell in my eye. It comes with um it comes with like care instructions for the wig. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry guys. It comes with care instructions for the wigs and everything. Um to, to you know send you like a little thank you note for thank you for your purchase. Hey, look what else it comes with. Handy dandy um uh, wig caps, right? So about to pop it on. Let's see. Invisible nylon hair nets with elastic. Easy to apply. Size control makes one size fits all for most hair. So anyway, y'all know I got these locks. So I did twist them down. And I am confusion. But we're gonna go like this. Okay, so maybe this isn't a wig cap. I don't know, but It's gonna be a wig cap today. So I got my handy dandy wig cap on. And I'm gonna pull it out the bag so my beautiful can see. Alright, it, it came with the the mesh netting. But like I said, I have already taken this out once before. And obviously I couldn't get it back in like it was when it first came. Now this is I have not done nothing with this wig, beautiful. This is how the wig came to me. This is what it looks like. Um I think I think it's 24 inches. I think it said 24 inches, if I am mistaken. But this is what it looks like and everything. It still has the lace front on it. You can see it has the adjustable straps. I'm about to hook hook one side back. Adjustable straps. Basically, your standard standard wig cap. It has a lot of combs in it. It has one, two, three. It has three combs. I was gonna say four at first. One, two, three. It has three combs in it. So one, two, three. So front. They're all in the front. So it's like center side side right there is not a comb in the back so we're just going to go with the tightness of the elasticity <laughs> did i just make up a word Sticity is going to get it for us right so let me put this on before i cut the lace off right let's just do this let's see what's popping tons hold on girl hold on y'all want to um hold on girl let me do this girl let me do this all right, before hold on, I'm gonna loosen up the maybe the let me put it on the next the next one under because maybe that was too tight. 
baby. Mm. All right. So, ready? One, two, three, go. Let's try this again. Try this again, girl. All right. Let's get this thing going. Pull it down. And... I'm trying to make sure I got her adjusted right where, like, you know, the ears and stuff. I think that's it right there. So, I'm going to look at my handy dandy mirror, y'all. Okay. Y'all see, I started shining. Shit. When I got to work, I started to shine. Okay. So, let me look up in here. And this is what it looks like. Just slapping it on with the lace front still on, right? And I want to see something like, I don't want, okay, so y'all know I'm a lover of wigs, right? But I don't just want to wear this thing like, I don't know, I could. I mean, I don't want to just wear this thing like this, you know what I'm saying? Like, <sighs> I was talking to my girl Nicole earlier today. Hold on, y'all. Sorry, I'm, I am out of the uh camera i'm trying to get my my comb over here and i said girl i'm gonna try to put some baby hairs on this wig that they sent me because i want to be able to have it look more natural looking not just sitting not just sitting and resting right not sitting and rest like just imagine this just imagine all of this the lace front is cut off right i just don't want it sitting like this i want to be able to put a part in there or whatever i want to say you could probably part this thing pretty damn much anywhere right and um but my initial reaction from this wig is i i like she's luscious i love her she's no i don't want to say i love her but i love the lusciousness of this wig like i said 24 inches and I listen, I thought I was gonna do it on camera, but I'm not gonna do it on camera, y'all. I'm gonna, but let me give y'all these shots right here, real quick, right? So y'all can see what's going. Listen, this is what it looks like from the back. Look, about to be extra. Ah, can I get that leg up, y'all? Yeah, I can get that leg up. All right, about to be extra. So this is what she looked like. Like this from the back, right? Nice length. Lip, lip, lip. Nice length, right? Nice length. Twerk something if you want to twerk something. But um, but yeah, so nice length. Up in here. All in the camera. Right now. And um but I'm just gonna try to finesse something different for this um for this review, right? So, with all that being said, y'all, this is what it looks like straight out the bag. When I come back, ain't going to be no lace. Ain't going to be no lace. And we're going to try to work something with these, um, see if I can work a little bit of baby hairs. Okay? All right. I'll be back. Hey, beautifuls. I am back. Listen, you would think it's just been a hot second since I, you know, came back. You know, okay, back up here, right? No. I done lost lighting. It's dark outside. And uh, girls and boys, let me say this. If I sound like a broken record from the first transition to this one, I apologize because it's been so long. I don't even know what I said in the, in the first part of the video. It's probably been at least an hour and a half, almost two hours. I don't know. I should have looked at my phone. Hold on, I can tell you exactly how long it's been since I transitioned out. Because I put a tweet up. Let me see how long ago I put this tweet up, okay? Okay, I'm going to say an hour and a half because the tweet been up for an hour. Okay, so let's go with an hour and a half. And um, listen, so, like, I was super excited to receive this wig. Um, when I saw the picture 
of the wig on another young lady because the company reached out to me and, and said, hey, would you like to, you know, review this wig? And I was like, sure, absolutely. So the young lady in that video, you know, had like little uh, baby hairs cut out and, you know, laying down, whatever, whatever. Uh, real nice and sculpted. I ain't want to do no sculpted baby hair. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to do no sculpted. But I did want to have some baby hairs, but soft baby hairs. Okay? So, like, I'm going to come in closer on the side. And um, I did clip it short. You see how it's short right here? And then I did clip it because I just wanted to... I want it to look more natural, like it's actually growing from my fucking scalp. Okay? So, anyway, um, so I did that on both sides. So, if I switch it up and put the part over here, it's, you know, it's whatever. So, here's the thing. Again, if I sound like a broken record, I apologize because I'm all over the place now. I'm so flustered. Y'all just don't know how long I was working with this hair just to come back in and do this part. I'm being honest with you guys. I'm being so real right now okay i took a break just to put a clip on twitter you know and on um, snapchat and then like come back and start working with the hair i started working with the hair and listen i didn't think it was gonna be that hard to work with but my thing is it's not the hair it was like i like for me not really knowing i did things before the things I did, I should have took other steps prior to doing what I was trying to do. Okay. So for me trying to get these little little soft baby hairs popping, because I like I got on, like I said, they on this side too. So like if I ever want to pull the hair back, they there, you know, it'll just be soft, you know. So they there. But um I should have detangled the hair before I started you know, doing the baby hair process by coming down, parting the... If I have clips, I don't even know if it's safe. One time I thought I was recording and I wasn't recording, y'all. <laughs> I'm just saying. So I'll throw it in if I if I got a little clip, right? So the thing is, so I was like, shit, I'm already into it, blah, 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 blah. So I started, I said, once I just finally got clipped the baby hairs like I wanted, I said, all right. I, I need to go ahead and detangle this whole hair. So the thing was, man, um, you know, once you keep running your finger through the hair, it gets bigger and bigger, right? It just gets bigger and bigger. So, you know, I got my big hair, don't care going on, right? Now, y'all know I'm a big hair, don't care girl, but I actually like the original way the wig was already, um, uh, already set you know what i'm saying so um it's okay i can get that set back you know it's just going to take some time to, to get it back um i would just like first of all i do got the curl pattern you know in there i, I actually wetted the hair and i took some some mousse just to get the the curl pattern back and kind of bring the poofiness down from the hair so that that definitely worked and and you know i actually brought some sheen more sheen to the hair, I should say, because the hair uh, was already, um, you know, good stuff. But honestly, I can get it back to the natural state it came in. It's just going to take some time. Like, I would just wet this hair. I would, like, really, really, really wet this hair. Like, wet it. Wet it. No, no, no moist. Wet it. And then I would take this setting um, lotion and just run it all the way through and let it dry. Just let it, just let it dry on like a mannequin head or whatever. When I say wet, I mean like saturated. Because if you if you just do the mist, it ain't gonna weigh the hair down. So you want the hair to weigh down, go ahead and run the um, mousse through it, just let it dry all the way. And it'll get back to a little bit of uh, not less, not, it will get back to the less big hair don't care look that I got right now. But honestly, I'm like digging the big hair don't care look. Um, because after I ran my fingers all the way through the hair, it was kind of frizzy and all that stuff. So I needed to mist the hair and take that uh, set of lotion and um and run it through the hair. So and it's she's back to a, a better state than it was after. Let me just try. I'm trimming some stuff right now. Then after, you know, then when I first ran my fingers through it. So yeah, so we here and um we good to go now. 
Now I will say this. I don't like I said, first impression, the hair is absolutely soft. She's still absolutely soft. Even after the mousse I put on it and everything. I will say the first initial when I took it out the bag, there was a scent. Um after being aired out, you know, after the the first half or 30 minutes or so, or whatever, before I even did this, I noticed that there was no more no more scent on the hair you know you know what i mean so that that was a great thing as well um the hair itself um excuse me like y'all know i come up here and i give y'all variety with the styles and everything so but this hair right here is so much hair and it's like when you have a lot of hair, you don't need to do a bunch of styles, right? That That's how I feel. You don't need to do a bunch of styles when you've got a lot of hair. So, but I'm digging the state that the hair is in, but eventually I will saturate this whole hair and boom, have it look, have it a less, have, have less poof to it, right? All right, so with all that being said, um... Yeah, baby hair on deck. So, like, if I wanted to switch the hair on the side, you see how I got to pull? Like, and just say if I just wanted to pull it back, y'all, if I wanted to, I mean, I got the hairs there. So, it's different style. It's, it's styles there, but Jackie just, woo, y'all just don't know the work I went through to just get to the state to come back to the camera and record. You know what I'm saying? So, but it wasn't the hair, it was me because I was just trying to do something different, something I never done before, and it just took more time than I thought it would to, you know, get to where I wanted to to get back on camera. So anyway, so like, you know, the pull back effect. So if y'all want another style cuz this is look, Bohemian Rhapsody baby, push back. Cuz like I said, these are the little baby hairs, they're short hairs, but I took them loose and laid it down. And just put a little flower in there. Call it a day. Put a little flower. You're good. There you go. Sunflowers is my favorite flower. <laughs> just in case anybody was wondering. But, um, yeah. I, I feel like I'm ready to go on vacation and lay on the beach. Well, let's just, let's just stop the shits. I'm not wearing as much hair on vacation, but what I'm saying is with the flower on and whatever, I, I feel like I'm ready to just go parlay, you know, and relax. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. But that's another style you can do just to push it back and put a flower in there and keep it going. Or you just push it all the way back like this. Real simple hair. It's just let the hair do what it do itself. You know, you, you want like you want a lot going on. Pull, pull, push it to the front. Pull to the front. Push this back and keep it moving. And then just go like this. Keep it moving. It's not a whole lot you need to do. You don't need a whole lot of styles with all your wigs, y'all. I know, I, I know, y'all used to be giving it to you, but you know, it's just little simple things you do just to give you a different look. See how I just did this? See the wispy right here. Boom. Grab some more, boom, and then all you gotta do is like, you know, if you don't want the, um, if you don't want a flower, just get your bobby pin, right? Oops, did I? <laughs> just get your bobby pin and just pin that little wisp, and you're good to go. See this? It probably ain't even gonna catch all the way because I'm on camera. But see that little wisp? That's that's it. That's look, and then let it hang like so. That's that's all you got to do. You know, it's just like it's effortless. I and then perfect word because this hair is effortless. Follow me. Now see this little knot ball in there. I'm about to go and get that. There we go. Get that little knot ball out the way. And uh, it's the hair is just absolutely effortless, you know? And then it's like, I could probably take like six big sections or whatever and do two strand twists 
and let it sit overnight and then take the two strand twist out and you know that's another way to get your body back the, the curls or whatever if you don't feel like doing the mousse thingy so i mean but it's just so much to do with this hair y'all it's just like i know i could wear it up if i want to i could wear it <sighs> listen it just do what you feel you know but i will say i appreciate as um I, I'm saying the name all wrong, but I appreciate Asto, Asto's wigs for sending me this wig to review because it's really nice. Um, I'll probably get some wear out of it this winter because um, ain't nothing wrong. I mean, I got my lock journey going on, but who says who says you can't wear wigs, you know, when you got locks? Hashtag locks under wigs. Okay. So, anywho, y'all, 